It's Monday. I've started a diet. I'm not happy. <laughs> it's been the weekend, which means that there's some celebrity news about in the papers and online. We're going to go online first. Charlie Sheen has apparently got himself a new girlfriend. She's called Georgia Jones. Now, Georgia Jones is a little bit younger than Charlie, but never mind, I don't think she's going to really care because Georgia's a bit of a porn star, which means it doesn't really matter what age it is, she just likes a bit of cock. What a romantic picture this is. Charlie with a cigarette in his right hand and cigar in his left and she's got a cigarette in her right hand. Oh, the odour of romance around them must be absolutely exhilarating. It's newspaper time. Let's see what we've got. Front page. Gillian and the Drugs King. Ooh, Gillian. Britain's biggest ecstasy baron is allegedly going out with Gillian Taylor Forth. That woman who was off EastEnders. Britain's biggest ecstasy baron. At least she'll always be happy with him. Hey? Who? is Cara Boom. What's Cara Boom? Best pals with Kate Moss and Riri. <laughs> Who's Riri? I haven't got a clue. She's quite good looking though. Harry versus Daddy. Taylor's PA orders One Direction star to call romance. Who gives a crap? I don't care, he's got too much air, she's got too much money and probably no talent. I don't really give a damn. Get on, shag her, upset her, and then go off and shag something else. Who really cares? Ooh, that's, that's Demi Moore. Mud yoga. Oh, my life. Someone really needs to tell Demi that rolling around in mud ain't gonna knock 30 years off how you look, love. If I was to roll around in some mud, I'd just look like an even bigger fat pig. Next paper, this is always fun. Oh, the National Enquirer. Taylor and Harry, baby shocker. Uh, if they're talking about babies between Harry and Taylor, even though the other paper was as well, does that mean he's actually given a one? I mean, you know, given a one. Does that mean he's actually not a virgin anymore? Girls, you'd be heartbroken. Harry's not a virgin. Oh, what a pity. Ooh, Kane's ultimatum to Kim. Kim Kardashian caught in the middle of a feud as Bo Kane West demands that she choose between him and her mummager Chris Jenner. <laughs> I don't give a shit. I don't. I really don't. I don't care about him and I don't care about her. She's got a big ass. That's all I can tell you. Let's keep going. Keep going. There's got to be something. Oh, oh, here we go. Taylor's baby talk. She'd love to be a mummy as soon as possible. Right, Harry, put a condom on. Otherwise, it's going to cost you a huge amount of money. Just, just put a condom on because otherwise, it's just going to be over. All those nice cars and things that you bought, it's, it's going to be over. Yeah. Mind you, she don't really need the money, does she? Because she's got loads of it anyway. But Harry, if you are given a one, put a condom on. Oh, Mila Kunis, is this the world's sexiest woman? Well, could be, don't know. She is quite fit, but everyone has an off day. Even me sometimes. I mean, to look like this takes a lot of hard work. Bubbles dumped by Michael's family. Jackson's clan turns back on King of Pop's chimp. Really? That's my roundup of the newspapers from the weekend. Bye! Me to do. I am like a lot of people. Carrying a few Guinness World Records are massive. And there are people what I'm going all to say over to you the world might doing come as a weird and wacky surprise. things because trying to get themselves to in the go book. on. Guinness, you don't release to be joining some expensive gym.